What does it mean that you desire to use a person for your own pleasure? What does it mean? Who are you? What are you doing? How do you think? How do you think? How the hell do you think? Who are you to use a person that is tired? To use a person that is sad? To use a person that doesn't want to use you? The person that wants to stay, to be alone? A person that wants to be quiet? If she was not 100% satisfied to be with you in that night, 100% with a complete heart and a wishing soul and she loves you and she miss, misses, misses you and she wants you and she's desiring you, if she's not desiring to be with you now, it calls Bene Anusa. It's not Hasidut, Shulchan Aruch, it calls Bene Anusa. Your children that are going to come will be a children of a woman that's been raped. That's the meaning of the word Bnei Anusa. Tavat Ni'uf, lust for women. What does it mean? It's hard. It's the hardest Tava. What do you mean? Who are you? With who we're talking to? No, but I'm losing my mind. I'm getting crazy. And those disgusting men are going to their wives. I'm going to have Zerah Lebatala. I won't control myself. I'm going to have dreams. My seed, my sperm, my whatever. Go to hell. Go deal with your problems. Go to a therapist. Leave your wife alone. What are you talking about? She gonna make you sin? That's what people are saying. This is why rabbis are telling you this, their students. This is what rabbisons are teaching the new brides, the women, the, the kalot. You need to sleep with your husband that he will not gonna have zerah lebatala, that he will not gonna sin at night. If she wants him, Great, no problem. I don't mind. <laughs> Enjoy, have fun. It's your life. No problem. But if she doesn't want, and you're going to force her, and she needs to swallow that frog every night, what's that? That's impure. That is contamination. Contaminated way of thinking. The pure way, the right way, the way of the righteous people is that they are keeping mitzvat onata. They are with their wives when their wives want them. That's the verse. Onata lo igra. When she wants you, don't say no. That's the halacha midoraita of how you allow and supposed to be with your wife. When she wants you, never tell her no. Always make her feel the best. Make her enjoy. Make her happy. Make her satisfied. Do whatever it takes to make her happy when she wants you to make her happy in that way. And if she wants you to make her happy in a different way, means just go to the park, just hold her hand, just tell her how amazing she is, just buy her gifts, just spend time with her, talk to her, share, just I don't know what. So that's how you're going to keep Vesimeach et Ishto, make your wife happy.